cauliflower soup. Um, it's a little ucky outside and rainy and muddy so we thought we'd make something warm for our tummies. So um, let's get started and show you what all you're going to need. It is raining, huh? Yeah, it's so dirty. Yeah. Okay, so what you're going to need, um, I usually put some, what is this, um, some celery. And I forgot what they call this type of cabbage, but I get cabbage and then I get a head of um, cauliflower. And I don't use all of it, I just use some of it. For some of it, I, um, I bread it and I fry it, it's super good. Um, couple eggs, some pepper, and I use beef bouillon. You can use chicken broth, beef broth, whatever you like to use. Um, you're gonna need a pot and a little helper. Can you say hi? Hi. And um, we'll get started. You gonna help me? Oh, you need help me. Okay, we are gonna get started by cutting up our cauliflower. Okay, you gonna help mommy put this in the... <laughs> put that in the trash? Thank you. Good job. Okay, let's see. We're going to cut these ends off here. You know what? Let's cut it in half. Day today. Mm -hmm. Put that in the bowl. Okay. In the bowl. Put that in the bowl. That in the bowl. Yeah, in the bowl. Yep. Oh, thanks. Welcome. You need to cut it. Yeah, this one's a big one. This is a big one. Oh. You do it in the bowl. Put uh -huh. that in the bowl. Oh. 
we kept um, our cauliflowers kind of in whole pieces is half of them are going to go into our soup and half of them are going to go into our um, cauliflower into our fried cauliflower recipe which I will um, film separately but you are going to put all this in a um, depending on how much soup you want I usually make a pretty good amount um, how many quarts is this? this is a four quarts. I usually make more than that, but then um, I don't want to go to waste. So um, fill it up maybe up to three quarts, two and a half quarts, and then um, put... Here. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. You start to cook. <laughs> yeah, you start to cook. So fill up your um, pan you can or pot. You can get a bigger one. I usually use... Um, I put the water in and I usually use a cup. Uh huh. I put a couple of spoonfuls of my bouillon in there or whatever you want if you want chicken. Yeah, hold on. Um, you can use, uh, as I said before, chicken uh, broth or beef broth. So, anyway, we're going to fill up our water, put this in there. Um, it's going to come to a boil, and then when it comes to a boil, you're going to stick your cauliflower in there. So, um, let's start that. What are you doing? Well, I gotta put water in there. always add more if we want it to have more. Put this on the oh, put this on the stove to cook. We gotta cut other stuff. take some of this ugly stuff off. Trash? Trash? Oh. 
we had a rabbit, we could give it to a rabbit, but we don't have a rabbit. Thank you. Ooh. Okay, um, you know, I should probably mention you should, you might want to wash your cauliflower and, um, your cabbage and your celery. Wash all that up. Uh huh. We are doing it. Okay, I'm gonna wash this and see if I want more. cut my cabbage to kind of small pieces um because my kid here is like a soup eater so soup eater? yeah soup eater so we're gonna cut them into pretty small pieces yeah more pieces you love your soups soups yes oh, okay. mm -hmm. for celery too. You can't just have cabbage in there.
trash. Trash? Mm -hmm. She wants to join in. Come on, 
to be um, battered, you're going to need some good old fashioned all-purpose flour, the breadcrumbs of your choice, and some eggs. Okay, so our water is boiling. Pouring it slowly, I'm gonna mix. I'm gonna mix the soup around so it kind of goes all over. Well, you don't want to stick your finger in there, Okay.
Okay, so if you want to add, um, if you want to add some salt in there, you can. I usually wait till I pour my own bowl of soup to kind of adjust the taste. And um, just cook that till. Yeah, it already starts to cook. So cook that until all your ingredients are pretty cooked through. And then um, you got soup and that's it. And then um, let's get started on our breaded, breaded, breaded cauliflower. Let's see if it's cooled off by now. Still looks a little warm. turned our um, oil on so that gets nice and warm. Make sure you keep an eye on that just so you don't burn your house down. That would be tragedy. <laughs> that would be bummer. Thanks. Yeah, that would put a damper on the meal. <laughs> All right. So flour, egg, breadcrumbs. I'm using Italian style breadcrumbs because that's what I got. That goes there. Where are you going? You leaving me? What's going on here? It's okay, Mom. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, Careful and fall into the trash. You can close the trash for now, I think. Watch your fingers. Thanks, big sissy. Uh oh. There's something going on over there. You know, it's probably be smarter to use a spoon to scoop this. Pretty 
Okay, so it's ready. So we stick our cauliflower in there. And I made a bowl with some paper towels in it so it can soak up some of the excess, um, excess oil. Probably not the best thing for you to eat. Okay, let's check on our soup. You can always put more flour in it to make it a little bit thicker. You can also put like sausage or kielbasa or something in there. I wish I had that. I'll put some of that in there. But I think. Everything seems to be everything seems to be cooked well. I think it needs something. Hmm. Needs something. Let's check on. Gosh, what do we put in there? I need something. What do I need? Oregano? Maybe some basil? Maybe basil. By the bite. Seep, seep. And that's the deep combo. Oh, I wish I had some fresh parsley. I think parsley might make it. Let's throw some dried stuff in there. Let's see if that works. Turn that back on. Get those flavors in there. Never put this stuff in there, basil or parsley, but let's give it a whirl. Maybe a teensy tiny bit of salt. Okay, let's cook that in there for a little bit, and maybe that'll do. Let's check on this here. Mess is for mom to clean it. Let's fry a little more. You want to get it to be like a golden color. All right. I think those have been fried long enough. Put our other ones in there. This is what happens when you let your kid play in the kitchen. Mom, I want more. You want more what? I want more. Um, I think you've had enough, no? Yeah. Yeah, look at all that. It's all over the chair, all the floor. Floor. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. What are you making? Are you gonna make you're gonna bake something? Yeah. What are you baking? I I can make my cooking. Alright. I'm making my sauce. You're making sauce? Yeah. Mmm, that looks like it's gonna be a yummy sauce. Yes, it is. Okay.
Okay, so as soon as your cauliflower's done frying, your soup's done, your cauliflower's done, and we're ready to enjoy. And I gotta go clean this mess up. So we're gonna bake cupcake cupcakes next. So we'll see you guys on that video. Say so see you later. Oh, say it again. See you later. Okay, <laughs> thanks. Bye, guys.